Hi Tom, it's a quick video of the Corvette. I don't know if you can get a good picture in the sun, but I'll just go around it for you. actually got sun out today so it's not a very good image so it's been painted matte black there's a few battle scars on it like this one just round the in the lens there uh, it's had a bit of a scrape See tops, the paint's just peeling around the edges. Basically, what you want from the car, you need a paint job, but to me, I'm not bothered. Underneath, it's really clean. Oh, we can get a look at that. I'd say there's hardly any, if any, rust. If there is any, I'd say it's just a bit of top rust. All tyres are good. Loads of meat left on them. Nice set of, I think, the original wheels. The interior, I'd say, out of 10, probably about 7. Needs a new carpet, or door mats. That's a light, that's, that's not water, that's a big shadow there. <laughs> Just a bit worn out, the carpet. The seats, quite a good nick. A little hole there. That's the driver's side door panel. It's got masking tape on it. A little bit tatty. Passenger side, it's not too bad. The dash top I was telling you about. This one's a. Uh, Put masking tape on that. No radio. It never had the panels for the T tops. In the back, it's not too bad. Needs a bit of a clean. It's got a um, battery kill switch on it for security. The adjusters on the back of the seat are a bit a bit worn, but you don't usually move them about. The seats slide backwards and forwards okay. The seat belts are a bit dirty but they work. As you know it's probably got a I've got a tilt steering column. Just so there's no radio. Fits in there. Start up. Try again. It's been stood a few days. Nope. Got 
be able to hear the tapping. Obviously sounds better from the back. Get to the front. That's the tapping noise on about. Brand new distributor. So it's had the top end redone. The bottom end's gone on it. On its way. It is drivable. Windows work, electric. The headlamps do work, main beam and dip, so they don't pop up on their own. You probably know it's due down to the actuators. Which of these here look a bit rusty, so they probably need, you can but get a rebuild kit for them, and it should hopefully sort them out. But they do work. So that's basically it. Obviously I'm no cameraman. But it's a cheap vet for the money. Looks a bit ratty. But it's been called the Batmobile by a few people. But it is what it is. So it's a lot of car for the money. That's it. See you soon, mate.